I might pass out y'all. Wait, 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 oh my gosh. Good morning, you all. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. Face, baby. The face is giving what she was supposed to on Christmas. Probably the first time this year where I put a pop of color like this, but I was really feeling it today. So today's December 25th. It is Christmas. And I just want to take a minute to say Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays to each and every one of you guys. As we are closing in Vlogmas, I just want to express gratitude and express, um, you know, just how much thankful I am for my YouTube family, for the continuous love and support that you guys always pour onto me. I thank the men above for this platform, for this community, for you guys. I hope that you're spending an amazing day today with your loved ones, with family, with friends. And if you, and even if you are spending it by yourself, I hope that you are finding peace and happiness and comfort in that. It's been an amazing month. It's been an amazing Vlogmas. I know your girl ain't been 100% consistent. We didn't do 25 days of Vlogmas, so we did it my way. But I am also really proud of myself for posting maybe 20 times out of those 25 days. And um, even on days where I didn't feel like picking up the camera and I was battling my personal issues and um, you know, just life. But what made it worth it for me was reading you guys' comments, just knowing that some of you guys were very excited to see my videos and waiting on it to unwind at the end of the day, that made it all worth it for me, okay? So yeah, um, we are in the middle of cooking right now. And by we, I mean my mom and I. Um, so most of my family is in Florida. So I didn't really get to spend um, Christmas with them, but I did spend Thanksgiving with them this year. So that made up for it. And um, everybody's getting their gifts. So it is what it is. Um, but I'm very blessed and very grateful to be spending it with my mom today. Um, girl, she has been up since five o'clock. She done got most of everything cooked. I am in charge of the scalloped potatoes, so I'm going to be making that. I just want to get ready and get cute first before we do that. We don't have too much on the menu. It's just her and I. So we have um, a whole chicken that's in the oven right now. I'm going to make some shrimp. We're making some rice. She's making some beans, um, plantains. I'm making a scalloped potato. Um, it's honestly, uh, it's a scalloped baked potato. So one of the best. So good. So, so good. I am gonna make a cornbread, I think, and then like a vegetable salad spread. She already opened up all of her gifts last night, y'all. So um, I'm going to give y'all a quick little recap of what I did yesterday as far as like going shopping. Cause yesterday, the only thing I did was going shopping for her Christmas gifts. Right now, you guys are going to see what happened yesterday. Give y'all a little recap of my day yesterday, which will probably be like, five minute worth of vlogs and then we'll come back to today okay so see y'all in five minutes what's up y'all good morning and welcome to a new vlog so today is actually christmas eve currently i am on the way to the mall girl i'm that girl on christmas eve i am that girl y'all already know the deal there is two more items that i want to get my mom just items that she's been talking about that i've just been hearing her talk about so i'm just like okay it is that time um let me run in here bright and early they literally just opened it is 10 a.m i'm here at lennox because i want to get her a north face jacket i'm letting y'all know because by the time y'all see this it'll already be christmas time she'll already open all of her gifts but one of the items that she well we were together one time and first of all my, my mom will always be underdressed she's that girl she's that caribbean mom with all the caribbean clothes so we was together one time and then this guy had this north face bubble type of jacket she was like oh i need me one of those i was like all right bitch. so i took note of that that day and it's crazy y'all because at 11 a.m the mall 
parking lot is already packed. That's crazy. We're gonna be in and out though. After I leave here, I'm going to Permita Mall because um, there are these Puma shoes that I have and she literally is obsessed with them. She always says how much she really wants a pair. So I'm gonna get her a pair of those and I'll show y'all what they look like later on, so. It is not a joke out here. <sighs> We're done. I came to Perimeter to get my mom those shoes that I was looking for. Foot Locker had them and they are the Puma Mid-Rise. I forgot what it's called. I forgot what the style is called, but they didn't have the black and white. They only have the all black, but I think she'll still like that one too. I also got her a Louis Vuitton perfume that she's been wanting. It's called um, Eau d'Absence. Yeah. And um, the shopping assistants in there said they love, absolutely love that scent. It's like an original. It's one, it's one of the best scents that Louis Vuitton has. It's such a classic. And there's also a gift that I got her maybe like a month ago. It's this necklace. It says mom. It's a gold necklace. It says mom with matching earrings. Of course, she could not wait to open up her gifts. Yes, man. Yes, yo. I always wanted that perfume. Oh. This is Louis Vuitton Eau d'Absence. And then that big bag behind the couch. Oh my behind the couch. gosh, that was a lot of awesome. <laughs> oh You deserve more. I'm making some dinner. So what I have on the menu is some pasta. I'm gonna make like a Tuscan sauce with spinach, tomatoes, Parmesan cheese, sour pasta. And then oh with shrimp and um, some lamb chops. Yeah, this is the what do you call medium it? bag. The medium brown bag, yes. Yes, the medium brown bag. Yeah, because you said you wanted one too. Yes, I wanted one. So I got her a brown bag. All right, y'all. We have a Tuscan shrimp. Lamb chops, of course. It's a video, my friend. That was parsley. Uh -huh. Oh, wait. You want some bread with it? Okay, we toast on the side. Merry Christmas, Mama Bear. Not like that. Merry Christmas, but not like that. <laughs> she said, not like that. This is by Julia's Place. I think I have the mini size. And the shade is red velvet. This is honestly my first time trying it on. This was like a blind buy, and I remember swashing it. And I wasn't really crazy about the color until I put it on. So it's not like your bright red. It's like a red with a pink undertone. All right, let's go get some shots. Come on. Shots time, come on. Okay, so we're gonna take some shots. Not we, you. No, for real. I mean, just a Merry Christmas shot. Peppermint twist, so. Half a shot. Okay, come on. Christmas, yes. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. When you drink it, you just chug it down. One, two, go. Mm. I might pass out y'all. I don't have to go to work tomorrow. Girl, you try to kill me. <laughs> this is my first time doing that. Ah! So how how I'm gonna taste those food now? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna make my scalloped potato, y'all. It is very simple. So my potatoes are already peeled. I'm basically just gonna cut them in very thin slice. I'm gonna make a bechamel sauce. And then we have ground turkey. Then you're gonna mix your potatoes. Mm -hmm. Here is the ground turkey. So then we are going to um, mix the thin sliced potatoes in the bechamel sauce. And then we're just gonna pop it in the oven. Okay, so it's very simple. I'ma just let the camera roll. Y'all, I feel this heat flowing through my insides right now from this drink. 
Do you not feel that? I'm not, I'm not feeling that. bechamel sauce is done with. I mixed in my potatoes in there. Okay, so we're gonna pour this on here. It's in a creamy. So we're gonna do one layer. Then I'm gonna do one layer of my ground turkey. Let me get a big fresh spoon. You can do ground beef if you want. I feel like ground beef will be more flavorful. Some Parmesan cheese. Ladies and gentlemen. All right, y'all, this is ready to go in the oven. If you didn't watch, um, what day was that? It was probably two vlogmas ago. I went um, shopping for some Christmas gifts and this is something I've been wanting all year. Investing in a nice quality jewelry piece for me and I'm very excited with what I got because it was just so hard to make up my mind. But let's go ahead and do the unboxing and then we'll get into the backstory on why I picked what I picked and what was so hard about it, right? The first one is the love ring. This is the thicker one. It is pink gold, cause they do have the yellow gold, pink gold, and I wanna say white gold. This is the pink gold. Ooh, this is the Justin Clou. Also in rose gold, 18 karat. Initially I wanted one ring y'all, but the hardest thing was trying to decide if I wanted the love ring or if I wanted the Justin Clou. And then when I started to stack them up together, it was just perfect. It was just beautiful. I'm very happy with my decision to get both because I was eventually going to get both, even if I had gotten one. Okay, my love ring is a 55 as far as sizing. Um, now, the 55 was generally the perfect size for me. That would go on like either my ring finger middle finger or index finger because those are the main three ones that I would want to wear it at but you know each finger has a different size but I wanted to find a generalized size to where I could basically switch it out for the most part here's a close-up of it and then I want to say the size of the Justin Clou is a 53 um now the Justin Clou fits different it's thinner so the sizing is different. And here it is, y'all. Another thing was the, engrave, the engraving. So you can get your rings engraved anytime you want to. Um, it was like a three to four business day time period. So I wanted to open this up on um christmas so i didn't get it engraved that same day but she was like you can just bring it back anytime you want and get it engraved um so she's cute so this mascala potatoes fresh out of the oven 
It is bubbling. I'm gonna let it see. I'm gonna let it cool off and then we'll do a taste test. But mm. So dinner is served. We got our scalloped potatoes, plantains, chicken, garden salad, and then I had some jerk shrimp on top of the salad. We also have rice and beans, but that's all I want to eat right now. Okay, we're going to build some gingerbread houses. I've never built a gingerbread house before, y'all, so this is all new to me as much as it is new to you. These are the sides. Comment down below if you've never built a gingerbread house like us because oh, so I know we can't be the only one. Upside down? Yeah. Because you're going to put the icing on this on those sides. A thick layer. I've never seen you so focused in my life. Okay. So now this is your foundation for your house. We're gonna put, okay. Yeah, if you feel like it's not enough to look, you can just go back. Let me tell you what's going to No! I didn't want to do it, but it's kind of fun. Of though. course. You and you wanted me to come one day after work to do that for you. The same way. Oh, wow. Okay, look, look at me, look at me, look at me. I'm trying. So I put it right here. Uh huh. But I don't see no bounce. You just screw it up. I'm not but can we eat it? I don't know. I'm done with mine. And you still struggling with yours? Oh wow! I'm done, baby. Oh yes. <laughs> Y'all, this is not gonna hold up. I have a bad feeling. So that's what I need to do. Can y'all <sighs> see? I I need to just put more icing in the middle. Oh, my. <laughs> wait, wait. You have to make them a deal. No, I'm gonna let you do your thing. No, I don't know, Nasa. Because it's a competition. Oh, no, that. Nah, that is a competition. I don't even know what I'm doing. You talk about competition. Come on, girl. I'm gonna get water inside our house. Yeah, your <laughs> house is gonna be flooded in a day. Because you're not closing it right. He's not gonna see. He's <laughs> <laughs> not, not, not straight. You, you see the top of my house. You see how, how straight yours is? Mine's not straight. I wonder why. Just watch. Not mine. It's not even straight. Boy, boy, boy! Oh my gosh, y'all, she's failing terribly, my love. I'm so sorry about that. This is the final look, <laughs> and I'm done, y'all. This is the result. <laughs> so this is my gingerbread house so far. I'm still working on it. We're still making. Some type of progress, and then my mom said she's done. So let me show y'all what her. Don't put like. your. <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> All right, y'all. This is my gingerbread house. I started strong. I ain't gonna lie to you. I kind of gave up. It is what it is. And then a lot of these little things are falling off. So that's that. I hope that you guys enjoyed today's vlog and I hope that y'all enjoyed Vlogmas in general. Don't forget to give this video a big old thumbs up, like, comment, and subscribe. I love you guys so, so much and I will be seeing y'all really soon. Your girl will be taking a short little break, maybe a couple of days, you know, we'll see. But we will be back stronger, better than ever. I love you guys so much. If you have not caught up to my Vlogmas series, then y'all need to make sure y'all go back and watch all of the videos. They're all worth it, I promise. I love you guys so much. Y'all be kind, stay safe, and I'll see y'all in my next video. Mwah, mwah, mwah.